Hi, my name is Chantelle and I am an extremely proud autism mom. I'd like to take a couple of minutes to just take you on a very short journey through the eyes and how we experience life with autism and ADHD. I would just like to start off by um, providing you with the definition of autism. So autism, but commonly referred to as Autism spectrum disorder is a neurological condition. It is a complex developmental condition which involves persistent challenges with social communication, restricted interests and repetitive behavior. This causes many, many challenges and the autism spectrum is extremely diverse. Autism provides a whole range of challenges in every single person's own journey so it ranges from the way they speak to the way they think the way each person or each child experiences emotions and even something as simple as sensory sensitivity to food colors environmental changes anything that is deemed as the norm and that most people take for granted and as something simple in life can produce a very big challenge to an autistic child. So our journey started quite a few years ago. My son was just over two and a half years old when he started to display very serious symptoms of autism. Um, he lost his ability to speak. Yes, I did say he lost his ability. Um, for a very long time I thought that he literally chose to stop speaking because of emotional trauma or something that he was experiencing that I didn't understand but throughout all of the education and the training and the research and the doctors and the therapists and specialists I was informed that he literally physically lost his neurological ability to speak at the age of two and a half years old. He also started to dis display extremely aggressive behavior and he was officially diagnosed with very severe autism and severe ADHD just after the age of two and a half years old. We went through a very difficult process of diagnosis with a clinical psychologist and a pediatrician and I immediately started with every single possible therapy I could find. I was privileged enough to be able to provide my son with resources and specialists in every single field because in South Africa unfortunately we do not have resources and we do not have aid or help or knowledge in this in, in this area or in this industry. You are told that your child is diagnosed on the spectrum and most likely you are provided with medication that falls in the antipsychotic category. So I was handed a diagnosis along with a prescri prescription for severe medication and told to put my child in a special needs school for a mother that was very traumatic but unfortunately for the medical field I refused to accept that.
and I had to do a lot of research and training on my own and I was fortunate enough to assist and aid my child with every single form of therapy that I could find. Um, we ranged from the clinical psychologist, uh, the pediatrician, music therapy, horse riding therapy, speech therapy, play therapy um, and uh, a specialist in the kinder kinetics field. So using all of that, working together every single day my child today, I'm extremely blessed to say that he is highly functioning and one of the most amazing human beings I've had the privilege to encounter in my life. Being a parent doesn't come with a textbook, but being a single mom with a child with autism and ADHD puts life in a complete new box and provides its own challenges. And as a mom, we are at the point where autism comes with no warning signs. It comes with no recommendations. It comes with no assistance. And we are at the point where we are entering a new phase of his life and his diagnosis. And unfortunately in South Africa, we do not have any resources or, or even specialists that can assist in this field. Um, no medical aid covers any of the costs. They don't cover any of the medication. It's not even recognized on um, most of the majority of the largest medical aids that we have in our country. That then gets to the point where we need to pay for everything ourselves. And at this stage in his life, we've reached a point where the med medication is not reacting at all. That being said, we need to raise funds in order to help this wonderful little boy to be able to function in society and be the best version of himself. We currently require um, several tests that need to be done by a lady referred to as the autism doctor. And a machine, if I can refer to it as that, um, that I will be ordering from abroad, which focuses on the vagus nerve stimulation specifically focused and created for aiding with the symptoms of autism and ADHD. So that is what this video is for. An extremely proud mother asking for the assistance of each and every person watching today.